We all suck sometimes in logic building while coding. In such cases, lead code could be your savior and somehow your best friend to help you to crack big coding interviews. But what is lead code? Well, it's a website for coders to study and solve various problems regarding data structures, cell, JavaScript, SQL, etc. In the lead code, we get every day a new question to solve. Also, there are thousands of problems available to try and hands on. Enough talk, let's analyze the lead code interface and its features. As you first land on the lead code homepage, you'll see a clean and Intuitive layout, there is a search bar at the top of to find problems and various tabs for exploring different resources. Let's dive into some sections. On the left, you'll find the problems tab. This is where you can browse and select problems to solve. Each problem is clearly labeled with its difficulty label, and you can even sort problems based on their type of popularity. In addition, there are explore tab. Here you'll find various learning resources, including topic wise tutorials, problem solving strategies, and articles of data structures and algorithms. To the right, there is a contest tab, where coding competitions are regularly held. Participating in these contents can give you a sense of real-time problem-solving experience and can be a great way to gauge your process. Now let's solve a problem to give you folks a rough idea of how things work. So there's a problem that says increment the large number by one and return the insulting error of digits. Now I choose Python to code to solve this problem. You can choose your favorite language and now I will hit the submit button and that's it. That's how simple solving problem in lead code is. That's how the entire interface works. Now I think we are done with the interface. Now the question is what are the tips to win the lead code race? First start with the easy problem and don't be sad if you can't solve them because sometimes lead code's easy problem is the hardest one see the solution and try to implement it and move to the next one one of the key strategy is consistency practicing a variety of problems regularly to keep your problem solving skips sharp. secondly focus on understanding the logic and algorithm behind the problem rather than just getting the correct answer but 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 one thing is before you jump into lead code have at least one programming language in your portfolio and the basic understanding of data structures and algorithm furthermore it's important important to remember that it's not about how many problems you solve, but how well you understand them. Instead of rushing to solve as many problems as possible, take the time to deeply understand each problem and its solution. Participation in lead code's discussion forum can be also very beneficial. You can a lot of from solution and explanation provided by the users. Remember the goal of using lead code is not just to pass coding interviews, but to become a better coder and problem solver. There is also a premium for lead code, but for beginners, I won't recommend it. Enjoy the code maxing fellas, I think that's it for the video.